Well, a year. How long is a year? Like forever. Actually, it's 365 days. Oh, that's so long. How long now? It's still 365 days. Oh, I wish I could have a birthday every day. Yeah, me too. With a party every day. Fun. That's a great idea for a story called... Every day's a birthday. <laughs> Once upon a time, Hansel and Gretel decided to have a birthday every day. And I'm going to go first. And I'm tomorrow. Fantastic. We've got everything we need. Uh, what about guests? Oh, yeah. I almost forgot. <laughs> <laughs> we can be the guests. Yeah, but we need a present. How about this harmonica? Perfect! Go, go kitty kitties, let's go! Happy, Happy birthday, birthday, Hansel! Hansel. Thank you. Who wants to play a game? <gasps> Pin the tail on the elephant? I love that game! <laughs> Watch and learn, Kate. I'm the best at this. You're the best. Oops. <laughs> Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Hansel. Happy birthday to you. Oh, hooray! <laughs> Wonderful. Have some cake. Thanks. Yummy. Mm. I could eat this every day. Time to open your present. Oh, yeah. I love birthdays. Great, because tomorrow is my turn for a birthday. And then mine. And then mine. And so the next day, Gretel celebrated her special day. Surprise! Oh, a party? I had no idea. <laughs> Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Gretel. Happy birthday to you. And many more. And so the next day, and the next day, and the next day, it was party time. Again. And again. Again, and again, and again. Thirty birthdays later. Good morning, Kit. Your turn. Again? Mm, I think the elephant has enough tails now. Let me guess. Another harmonica. <laughs> oh, no. Not more cake. Yeah. Can I have something else? Like a salad? Sorry. All we have is cake. This doesn't feel special anymore. That's because special isn't special if it isn't special. So true. So true. Maybe tomorrow we can just have a normal day? Yeah. Porridge and then the park. Yay! Yay! Normal day! Why didn't we think of this 29 birthdays ago? I guess a birthday every day isn't such a great idea. Yeah, because then it won't be special. Don't worry. There are lots of other special days in the year, like Christmas. Yeah! What is that? In four months. That's like forever, too. How about now? Is it closer now? <laughs> go, 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 go. Where will we go? Who will we be? What will we do? Who will we see? It sure will 
Time for bed, kittens. Aw, if we were grown-ups, we could stay up late. That would be so much better than being a kid. Wouldn't it be great if there was a machine that could let you change who you are? Hey, why don't we make up a bedtime story about that? Yeah! And I know just what we'll call it. The Changeinator. <laughs> <laughs> Once upon a time, there was an inventor who invented all sorts of things, like a machine... That would tickle you! <laughs> <laughs> and another that could... Eat your vegetables for you! But his greatest invention was the Changeinator which could change you into whatever you want it to be. Yes! Ah, it's finished. Now I just need a couple of guinea pigs. We could be guinea pigs. Or regular pigs. Or aardvarks. Or anything. Go, go kitty kitties, kitties, let's go! Hi, we'll be your guinea pigs. But actually, we'd prefer to be bats. Great! Yeah, bats can stay up all night. And fly where they want. Then bats it is. Put these on. If you decide you don't like being bats, call out Changeinator and you'll get sent right back here. That'll never happen. Ready? Ready! Wow, we're really bats. And we're really flying. In the middle of the night. Daddy's dinner! Just in time! I'm hungry! Me too! You're in luck! I made your favorite! What's that? Bugs! What else? Yuck. yuck! What do you mean, yuck? Bats love bugs! Not this bat! Changeinator! What? You didn't like being bats? But eating bugs? That's gross! Well, would you like to be something else instead? How about... fish? Yeah! It'll be awesome to swim underwater! Then fish it is! Ready? Ready! Ready. Wow! Swimming's even better than flying! Your bubble looks like a crab. How about this one? <laughs> a turtle. How about this? Shark. No. Duck. No. No, kid duck. A shark. Ah! Changeinator. Hey, I just cleaned that. I don't want to be a fish. I want to be a skunk. Then skunk it is. P U, you stink. I want to be a porcupine. Then porcupine it is. Ow, that hurts. Sorry. I want to be a snake. Then snake it is. Ah! I want to be a tyrant. Wait. There's only enough changeinator juice for one more change. Whatever you become next. That's when you'll stay forever. Then we want to be kittens. Ah, good choice. Kittens it is. And so Kit and Kate turned back into kittens and landed safely in their own beds. Their warm, comfy beds. Yeah. Sure you don't want to switch places with me? I'll go to sleep, and you can stay up late to do the laundry and dishes. Sounds really fun, Mom. But we'll just dream about it instead. <laughs> <laughs> What will we do? Who will we see? It sure will be 
Kittens, my friend's gonna be here soon, and she's bringing her little boy Nicholas. I'm sure he would love to play trains together with you. Uh, but what if he breaks them? He can play with this bear. Or how about we make up a story that you could tell Nicholas? It could be called The Host with the Most. <laughs> <laughs> Once upon a time, there was a lucky pup who lived in a super cool mansion. And one day, he got a letter from two of his best friends saying they were planning to visit him. Oh, we'll have so much fun! Hey, we could be his friends. And play all day in his cool house. Cool! Go, go kitty kitties, let's go! There you are! What took so long? Come on in! I made us lunch. Ooh, fish. It looks so delicious. Oh, no, that's for me. Those are for you. Have as much as you want. You don't have any more fish? Of course. Halibut, sea bass, and tuna. Can we have some? Well, no. That's mine for tomorrow, the day after tomorrow, and the day after that. Aw. <clears throat> That was delicious. Now, let's go play. But... Wow! You have your own racetrack? It must be so much fun. It is. Do you want to see how much fun it is? Sure. Yeah! Great! Then watch me! Oh, We must be taking turns. Well, what do you think? It's awesome! It sure is! Oh, when is it our turn? And the winner is... What? Me? I don't believe it! Pop! What? 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 Oh, of course! You must be tired from all this excitement. Time for a nap. Whoa! What a great room for a nap! That's the biggest bed I've ever seen! I can't wait to sleep. Oh, no, 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 no. This is my room. Yours is next door. Ah. What a surprise. It's okay, Kate. How bad can it be? Pretty bad. <laughs> That's it. I've had enough. Yeah, let's go. Hey, you really know how to power nap. No, we're leaving. Oh, but why? We had such a great day. Maybe you did, but we didn't. Here's what you wanted us to eat. Oh. Here's what we didn't do. Uh. And here's where you wanted us to sleep. Ah! Oh, 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 I'm such a silly sausage. I was so busy enjoying myself, I wasn't thinking about whether you were having fun. I'm so sorry. Please stay and let me show you how much fun you can have here. Please, 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 please. Okay. And so the pup tried again. Bon appetit. Fish. Fish. Yummy. But this time, he made sure that everything they did was fun for all of them, not just himself. Watch me. And the winner is us. And much to the pup's surprise, he found that sharing his favorite things actually made him feel better than having them all to himself. <sighs> Nighty night. Hmm. <sighs> Sweet dreams. What a great day. Great story, Mom. I'm sure Nicholas would like it. But he'd probably like playing with our new trains a lot more. Won't be needing you. Aw, I'll fix you up. Choo-choo! <laughs> go, 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 go! Where will we go? Who will we be? What will we do? Who will we see? It sure will be 
Are you crumpling up another drawing? It's trash. Trash? Let me see. You could turn this into a wonderful drawing. But Kit wants it to be perfect. Perfect? Well, I know a perfect story. Want to hear it? Sure. What's it called? Picture perfect. <laughs> <laughs> Once upon a time, there was an alien chef from Planet Perfect. He had perfect green skin and a perfect spaceship. He came to Earth to find the perfect dinner to serve that night on Planet Perfect. But the alien had no idea what Earth food even was. First he tried to eat... A shovel. Yuck. An old boot. A dirty diaper. You. The food on this planet is terrible. He sure won't make a perfect meal if he doesn't even know what food is. Kit, let's be farmers and help him pick some yummy veggies for a perfect meal. Perfect. Go, go kitty kitties, kitties, let's, let's go. go. Howdy. Need some help? Yeah, I need to make a perfect dinner, but this food is disgusting. <laughs> That's not food. What you need are some yummy vegetables. Exactly. What are vegetables? Come on, we'll show you. These are vegetables. You can make a delicious soup with them. Perfect. This is called a carrot. They're delicious. No good. What's wrong with it? Can't you see this spot over here? You can't make a perfect meal unless you use perfect ingredients. Oh, okay. Look, broccoli. Worthless. See, this part's greener than that part. Huh? Oh, right. Do you want these? Those? No. Then mind if I take them? They're perfect. <laughs> Maybe perfect for a trash collector. Here, these green beans are perfect. Absolutely not. They are all different lengths. Don't you have anything perfect here? Wait! Wait! What is this? It's a radish. Yes, this radish is perfectly perfect in every way. Now we can finally make the perfect vegetable soup. One perfect radish in perfectly boiling water. Bon appetit. Look. I think that diaper tasted better. Mm. What is that smell? Wow, big place you got here. Who made this soup? I did, from all the vegetables you threw away. But they weren't perfect. Perfect enough for me. Try some. It's, it's, it's perfect! Can I please take some back to Planet Perfect? Pretty please? Take the whole pot. There are plenty more perfectly good vegetables in the garden. Thank you. If I leave now, I can beat the traffic and get back by dinner time. Farewell, Earthlings. That story was perfect, Grandpa. And look what I made from your drawing. It's perfect. It looks just like the alien. I'm going to fix one of my drawings now. That's great, Kit. Except for one thing. What's that? It's supposed to be the spaceship. <laughs> <laughs> Oh,
Fish sandwiches coming right up. Here's the cucumber, Mom. <laughs> and here's the lemon. <laughs> Come on, I'm trying to make us lunch. But <laughs> we're the corny kitties. We have to be funny. But you know Corny's secret to being funny, right? No. no. Well, you will, right after I tell you a very funny story called A Corny Secret. <laughs> <laughs> Once upon a time, Corny Cat was getting ready to put on a very funny show when he got some very bad news. Bad news, Corny. Quick Quack and Quig can't do the show tonight. They're sick. Hey, hey, hey! That's not funny. We'll never find anyone else who can be ready before showtime. We can. We're the corny kittens. We were born ready. Go, go kitty kitties, let's go. Wow, that was fast. You're not joking. Places, everybody. So what do we do? Just go out there and sit down at the table. That's it? Oh, yeah, and that's really silly. Is that the secret to being funny? No, but don't worry. I'll tell you the secret after the show. Right now, it's showtime! Hey, hey, hey! Welcome to Corny's Cafe! I'm Corny, and I'll be your waiter this evening. Can I start you out with some fish? Oh, yes. We're really hungry. <laughs> Not for long. Oh. <laughs> hey! Where did they go? <laughs> bon appetit. I'm not so hungry anymore. <laughs> Me neither. <laughs> Be right back with the next course. <laughs> How about a glass of milk? Sure. We're really thirsty. Not for long. <laughs> Excuse me, where's the milk? I just needed to warm it up a bit. <laughs> Your milk is served. <laughs> uh, I'm not so thirsty anymore. Oh, me neither. <laughs> then can I get you anything else? Uh, just the check, please. Please? <laughs> Great job, Corny Kittens. You are hilarious. Thanks. All that joking around gave me a real appetite. Then just sit back down. It's time for a real lunch. And for dessert, <laughs> the secret to being funny. <laughs> Two lunches coming right up. <laughs> 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 Funny, right? Um, we're really hungry. Quit joking around. Okay, let me bring you some pie. Oh, want some? It's delicious. Stop it. This isn't funny. But you loved these jokes before. Because then it was showtime. But they're not funny when it's lunchtime. <laughs> hey, hey, hey! You already knew the secret to being funny. Oh, I get it. Jokes are only funny when the time is right for joking around. Anybody for a little sandwich? Little? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry for joking around before. It wasn't the right time, Mom. Here's the real cucumber. And the lemon. Thanks, kittens. Here you go. Bon appetit. Huh? Hey, hey, hey! <laughs> gotcha! <laughs> <laughs>